Factors Understanding factors of a number We use factoring when we must divide something into equal pieces. For example, if six people worked together to make brownies and the pan of brownies yields 24 brownies, it would only be fair if everyone received the same number of brownies. Because 6 is a factor of 24, the brownies can be divided into equal shares without cutting them into smaller pieces. Dividing 24 by 6 gives a result of 4. So, each person gets 4 brownies. We also use factoring while shopping to compare prices per unit. For example, there are two brands of pens on sale. A 12 pence packet costs 360 rupees and a 6 pence packet costs 240 rupees. Using factors, we can compare the price per pen without using a calculator or notepad. Dividing 360 by 12, the factors of 360 are 30 and 12. Dividing 240 by 6, the factors of 240 are 40 and 6. Using this information, you know that the 12 pence packet costs 30 rupees per pen and the 6 pence packet costs 40 rupees per pen. Factors are the numbers we can multiply together to get another number. 2 and 3 are factors of 6. A number can have many factors. 3 multiplied by 4 equals to 12. So, 3 and 4 are factors of 12. Also, 2 multiplied by 6 equals to 12. So, 2 and 6 are also factors of 12. And 1 multiplied by 12 equals to 12. So, 1 and 12 are factors of 12 as well. Factors a number which divides the given number exactly is known as a factor of the given number. Example, 1, 2, 3, 6 divides 6. So, 1, 2, 3, 6 are the factors of 6. We can write 18 as a product of 1 times 18 is 18. 2 times 9 is 18. 3 times 6 is 18. The factors of 18 are 1, 2, 3, 6, 9 and 18. Let us write the factors for the number 30. We can write 30 as a product of 1 times 30 is 30. 2 times 15 is 30. 3 times 10 is 30. 5 times 6 is 30. Therefore, the factors of 30 are 1, 2, 3, 5, 6, 10, 15 and 30. We have some important points to remember about factors. The first one is, 1 is a factor of every number. For example, 1 multiplied by 5 equals to 5. 5 divided by 1 equals to 5. 1 multiplied by any number gives the number itself and any number divided by 1 gives the number itself as a quotient. Every number is a factor of itself. For example, 5 multiplied by 1 gives 5. 5 divided by 5 gives 1. Thus, 
any number multiplied by 1 gives the number as a product. Any number dividing the number itself gives 1 as a quotient. The factor of a number is always less than or equal to the number. For example, the factors of 18 are 1, 2, 3, 6, 9 and 18. 1, 2, 3, 6, 9 are less than 18 and 18 is equal to 18. We can say that the factor of a number is always less than or equal to the number. Every number except 1 has at least two factors that are 1 and the number itself. For example, the factors of 7 are 1 and 7. We can write 1 multiplied by 7 equals to 7. No other pair of number when multiplied together would give the product 7. Factors are finite. 0 is not a factor of any number because we cannot divide any number by 0. 0 is not a factor of 0 too.